Good morning. So we are here ready for the fun with sounds. What will we need? Well, we're going to need my book of sounds for reading and our big idea book where we left off on Friday. We're going to do three pages in the big idea book, basically concentrating on that rule, the big idea, which we had talked about already put a silent E at the end of a word and the vowel before it says its name. Okay, so we're gonna be working on that. We're going to be um, doing three pages in the book. Uh, but let's go ahead and get out our pencil and we're going to need an orange crayon today. So let's go ahead and look at where, what, what we have done so far. So we, we know what the vowels are, A, E, I, O, U. We know that short vowels say A, E, I, A, A. We know that long vowels mean that the vowel says its name, A, E, I, O, U. And irregular sounds in words do not fit that pattern, do not have a short sound or a long vowel sound, okay? So let's go ahead and look at what we have done so far. We've looked at the three sounds for A. A has three sounds in a word. When we see a word with an A in it, it can have three possible sounds. It can say A as in apple. A I'm sorry. <laughs> What am I doing? Oh, silly me. Is that right? A as in apple? No. A as in apple. A as in April. And A as in want. Let's try that again. A. 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 Short sound. A. Long sound. A. Irregular sound. A. Then... C has two sounds. It can have the hard sound k, as in came, or the soft sound s, as in sent. Okay, so now let's go ahead and turn the page to page three today. And this week we're going to be focusing in on CH combined, CH together in a word has two possible sounds. Now, the one that we have been working on the most and we will work on the most this week in some follow-up work will be the digraph, ch, 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 like Chuck E. Cheese, ch, 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 okay? And we can hear that ch, diet, digraph at the beginning and ending of words. Let's go ahead and write that ch sound, ch, C-H, ch. And we're going to go ahead and give you an example word, and the example word is much, much, much. I love you so much, much. And then you're going to color this in because it's not a long or short vowel. It's an, considered an irregular sound. Ch, 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 ch. And we'll do some work with this ch sound later in the week. Ch. And then the other possible sound, which we haven't really mentioned, is it can also say just simply k, like a hard C, like the K. Let's draw in a K. K, K. An example word that has that hard K sound with a CH would be the word school. Sk, sk, sk. What do you hear? Ooh, school. 
many of you like school. Okay, so that's also going to be orange. We will see it. Not a lot. The, the digraph ch is more common. Okay, so let's go ahead and just review. CH has two sounds. It can say ch as in the word much or k as in the word school. Great. Think about that. Review it with your friends at home and we'll be back in a minute.